Hello! Welcome to this video tutorial on understanding the differences between popular and scholarly articles. As you proceed through your program at CUCA College, you may be required to find and cite scholarly journal articles in your research papers. But what is a scholarly journal and how is it different from a magazine or newspaper? Well, the first thing you should know is that all three are called periodicals because they are published at periodic intervals throughout the year. They are also referred to as journals. So if you hear the word journals or periodicals, you know that I am talking about newspapers, magazines, and scholarly journals. Today we're going to be talking about how to identify the different types of articles, since you will need to be able to distinguish between them for your assignments. Newspapers and magazines are considered to be popular sources, which means they are written for the general public. Newspapers are really easy to recognize when you see them in person. They're printed on a special kind of paper called newsprint, and they're folded rather than stapled or glued. They often have some ads and pictures spread throughout. But these clues are not really going to be as helpful if you're looking at an article online. So that's when you can use other clues to help you, such as looking at the content. Newspapers usually cover current events with a local or regional focus. The articles tend to be brief and have very few, if any, references at the end of the article. They are published very frequently, daily or weekly, but they do have editors to oversee the content. The publication process is very quick, with articles getting published within a day or a week of being written. Magazines are similar to newspapers in a lot of ways. They tend to be on glossy paper and have a lot of color, pictures, and ads. They cover special interests, such as business, science, fashion, or politics. They're also published a little less frequently than newspapers, like monthly or seasonally. This gives the writing, editorial, and publication process a little more time to occur. I would like to point out that a trade publication, also known as a trade journal or trade magazine, is very similar to a magazine. The main difference is that the intended audience is for people who work in a specific field or trade. If you are in need of a scholarly source, then what you need is an article from a scholarly journal. The main difference between popular and scholarly sources is the audience. Scholarly sources are written for researchers, or people who are experts in the subject area or field the journal covers. Scholarly journals are book-like, usually black and white, and have very few pictures or ads. The articles within are reports of original research. They provide in-depth analysis of specific topics and they have all their references cited. They're published less frequently, like quarterly or semi-annually. The editorial process takes much longer because the information within has to be thoroughly vetted. Furthermore, scholarly journals are usually peer-reviewed, and if they are, this process can lengthen the editorial process even further. This means that an article published in this month's issue of a peer-reviewed scholarly journal could have been written up to a year ago. But what does peer review mean exactly? Peer review is a process the editor of the journal uses to increase the credibility and trustworthiness of the articles they publish. They appoint a committee of people who are experts in the same subject area as the authors. Hence, they are called peers. This committee reads the article submissions and judges the quality of the research. Then, they recommend to the editor whether or not to publish the article. Sometimes the article is sent back to the author for revisions first. And then the editor makes the final determination whether to publish it. This can take a while, which is why the editorial process is longer for peer-reviewed journals. By the way, peer-reviewed articles are also sometimes called refereed articles. To learn more about how to find different kinds of articles using library databases and the web, check out my next video, Popular vs. Scholarly Articles, Finding and Identifying Different Types of Articles. You can find the link to this video in the description below. Happy researching!